This is a clear example of a spiritual husband, reality TV stars, and online in-laws drag Lord Lambert, a skit maker. Welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me once again. I appreciate you all so, so much. Please, if today is your first time, do well to smash on that subscribe button and turn on your post notifications so I'll be notified once I upload my videos. Thank you so much. My correct, correct people, then will matter no be here hmm. people are dragging this man like eh, i passed my neighbor generator lord lambert is a skate maker and he hails from anambra state near we to be precise he is very good at what he does his profession has really made him very very wealthy while queen mercy atang is from Akwaibo. She's a reality TV star. That is the main thing that actually brought her out, that made her a celebrity that so many people today know of, Queen Mercy Atta. So, this lady got involved with Lord Lambert and got pregnant for him. When she got pregnant, she showed it online. People were like, oh, why are you pregnant for another until she put to bed? When she put to bed, that was the worst of it all. They started calling her names. They started saying all sort of things to her. Who is the father of your child? The man is not showing up. You are not talking about the father of your child because you've been dating a sugar daddy because it's a sugar daddy that got you pregnant. He dares not come online to acknowledge that this child is his child or else the wife is going to show him Pepe. <laughs> My people, that is nothing. They did not call this girl, but she kept mute. She did not say anything. All this while, this young lady has been carrying this whole burden all alone, not sharing it with anybody, not coming online to come and say, see what Lord Lambert is doing to me, that actually he is the father of my child. She never did all of this. Now, a few days ago, she posted a video of her engagement with King David, a UK-based guy. Hmm. That is when the whole Wahala now started. That is when Lord Lamba now posted that actually he is the father of this beautiful baby right here. <laughs> Trust the online laws. They can make or mal you. Hmm. They now started coming for Lord Lamba. What is wrong with you? Remember, I said earlier that they actually came for Queen Mercy Atang when she put to bed of this child. When she posted her pictures, videos and everything, they came for her. But right now, they are on Lord Lambert. <laughs> they are giving it to him just like they gave it to Queen Mercy at and when she put to bed. They said, man, what is wrong with you? Why are you not coming out now to come and post? So you had all those videos, pictures, all this while. You did not post it. You did not say anything. Even when uh, they were dragging this girl for getting pregnant for the allegedly sugar daddy, you never said anything. Okay, if you didn't want to talk at all, may probably you should have posted a video of you and this baby. That would have said it all. He never did any of such. That is the annoyance of the online in-laws. Now, this dude right here, Lord Lambert, he posted this, he's a custody, seeking for the custody of the child in less than 24 hours that Queen Mercy Atang posted her engagement video. So, most people are saying this is pure jealousy. He is jealous because food has been taken out of his mouth, that he never envisaged that Queen Mercy could get a man like this to cherish her, take care of her, spend on her, and do every other biddings of Queen Mercy at time. Hmm. My correct, correct people, what do you guys think? Is it actually the reason why Lord Lambert is behaving like this? Because in less than 24 hours of seeing your baby mama's engagement proposal, and you already filed for the child's custody, like... You've been waiting for it. It's like he has gotten this custody wherever and kept it somewhere, just waiting for the girl to one day show that, oh, she wants to get married to another man. Then, boom, he brings it out. <laughs> but I was thinking that the reverse should be the case. I was expecting him to be happy for this young lady. Since you never proposed, he never asked her to marry you, you're not taking her serious, he should be happy that she is getting married. Of course, you should applaud her because... The child's birthday did not show up. He did not post anything. He did not come. He did not say anything about the child. Even in fact, you even went for the photo shoot, but you never posted any, and you never commented, "My beautiful baby." You know, nothing that shows you had no interest in this lady. So for her to see someone else who actually loves her, you should be happy for her. And again, from the information we gathered, is that this King David right here, the guy who just got her engaged was once in a relationship with her 
Probably they had misunderstanding before she now moved on and then got involved with Lord Lambert and got pregnant and put to bed for Lord Lambert, which Lord Lambert never showed interest in taking their relationship to the next level. Then, since Lord Lambert is not taking her serious, it seems she now went back to David. And finally, David has proposed with a diamond ring worth millions. A very big congratulations to Queen Mercy Atang. The Lord has remembered her to wipe her tears away. According to her, that is what she put up. Now, my queens and kings, my Korean Korean people, them, let's go to comment section and see how people are reacting to this. Let's see reality TV stars and online in-laws netizens how they are reacting to this particular case at hand. So first, let's see the things that Lord Lambert posted confirming or telling the online in-laws that this baby actually belongs to him, that he is the father of the child. So when he posted this video of him carrying the baby, he posted a baby's passport as well. Just look at my screen. You will see it there. That is for people to read that um, the baby is also carrying his name. You will see it right from there as they called her Adane Kali Kevin. Okay, that's uh, almost the father's name. She's sharing the same name with Lord Lambert. Do you get? So this is a proof of uh, Lord Lambert telling everyone, this baby belongs to me. This baby is mine. She's my child. So the first person that actually came for him is Angel of BB Niger. She is also a reality TV star. This is what Angel wrote for him. Angel said, You didn't post that beautiful girl since it's today you decided to. Some men can be. Then someone else came for him as well, called Yvonne. And also a uh, Sandy Baby. So many people came for him. Hmm. Nigerians, they are actually supporting this Queen Mercy Atang right now. <laughs> like I said earlier, those people, the online in-laws, can actually make or mal you. <laughs> Alright, so let's see this conversation going on here. So Yvonne said, not the passport page, a clear presentation of gaslighting. Then Sandy Baby said, honestly, couldn't even pose the daughter on her birthday after doing a photo shoot with her, but suddenly remembered he's a dad today. <laughs> then Yvonne replied, like he's been acknowledging or had posted her on or before her birthday. All of a sudden, you are posting her the same day your daughter's mom gets engaged. Not a clown? So right now, this particular comment, Angel or Bibi Niger actually took it to his page where he posted this things. So Angel went there and wrote this. Angel actually tagged him and said, when the baby was born, we were all here. When they called queen names, he didn't post. Today, she got engaged. He came out to post her. Yuck. All right, let's also see this influencer who has also spoken on this matter. This is Lord Lamba, a clear example of spiritual husband. Man, no one keep you. He no one let you go at the same time. Because I don't understand. All of us did the internet where Queen Gebele, where Queen Body speaking. People call Queen names. Some call Queen Ashawo, she did politician, she did this, she did that, she did this. Lambert did not come out to post to say, ah, I am the father of this child. This girl is pregnant for me. She's not what you people are saying. She's not the picture you people are painting. He kept mute. If not for the fact that this girl had thick skin and kept on with everything. That's one. Secondly, this girl cost the bondy speaking. Do one year birthday party. Do shoot. Lamba shoots. Lamba no post. How can I have a child for you? You did not see my family. There is no introduction. There is no marriage. And you have the audacity to be pissed that I am engaged. Sense of entitlement is that you? Let's be realistic. Lamba never there with another girl since. Lamba not the since. This one has somebody be said the girl or dates before. The best you can come back, you can say, ah, baby, if I think I can marry, we can actually have a life together. We've been together before. Then the guy comes, does what every sensible man is supposed to do, an engagement. And I think before the guy could even do engagement, a wedding is, is emotion. There's a party to plan. There's jollof rice to eat. I should be to be sold. And Lamba is sending her uh, court papers the very next day after engagement that he needs full custody of a child. He never posted. 
you never came out or made it evident you were the father of this child. Pettiness is that you? Like, how cheap and poorly do some men reason? Like, who raised a lot of you? It is one thing to be a celebrity. It's another thing to have sense. You can't shut people up. We just have to see our mind. If this is how lumbering your brain is lumbering, you have a lot of work to do mentally. Because this is way too petty. Now, I know I'm not in the relationship with them, but obviously before this girl could take an engagement ring from someone else, bros, if you wanted to, see, let me tell you, you cannot force a man to keep a man. If you wanted to bag this girl, you would have bagged her a long time ago. You are not broke. All the money to get married is your problem. You are wealthy. So seeing somebody else coming to take food from your mouth and it's now you want to get pissed, you cannot get full custody of that child. Trust me, I am not in support of any woman that has been raising her child single-handedly, giving it over to a man that will get married to another woman and your child will have to live with his stepmother. Lamba, rest in Jesus' name. Amen. Hey, is that amen for me? Well, my correct, correct, people, this is all I can take on this particular video. Thank you so much for watching. Let us know your thoughts on this particular matter down in the comment section below. Thank you so much. Bye.